Hello you guys, this is Slappy Panda Guy and welcome back to another Robots video. So I'm currently in a mission right now, which is good because I just went in perfect timing with the restaurant mission. So I found out where the plates are, they're right over here. I have no idea why I had to put them in the same unit or something, unless I was just blind or something. But uh, without further ado, let's get into the video and I am going to serve my customers. So yeah, okay. Um, okay, what does this customer want? Lettuce, beef, uh, well, meats, and okay. Okay, so it's just a usual burger, a regular burger. Get a plate. I think he's just doing it for me. I'll, I'll just, I'll just put it in here for you. And the lettuce will be chopped. They will go in here. There you have it. Put it in there. You are not in charge of this dish. Whoops. Okay. Um, I'll put it there. Um, I'll put it here. Oh, no. There. There we go. And then we need some buns. Is that the right buns? Is that the buns he wants? Yes. Okay. And with tomato. Okay, put it in there. Okay. One for you. There we go. Okay, so meat and burger. Okay. Meat and burger will go. The burger will go in there. Um, and as for you over there. Okay, so just with a tomato. Okay. So. Um, we'll put that in there. Oh no, wrong one, wrong one. Ah, wrong one. Three, two, one. There you go. Okay, give it to me. Ah, there we go. You, you're not in charge of this plate, seriously? Are you kidding me? So there's no point putting that there. Go. Dump it, throw it in the bin. There we go. Okay. Okay, someone just left their plate and trying to make me confused. Um, okay, I'll put loads here. I'm bad to these customers. Ah, okay. Um, okay, so bread and meat. Okay. Bread. Okay. And what does this one want? Oh, an extra tomatoes. I can do that for you. Okay, there we go. Tomatoes. Chop, chop, chop. There we go. Put them in there. And put this one in there. And put the other meats in there. Okay, yeah, in there. And we will give this one to... Okay, he ordered this one. There we go. You're very welcome. And, okay. Okay, this one, here you go, here you go, there we go, okay, and this one wants tomatoes and bread, okay, ready, okay, it's ready, okay, there we go, and tomatoes for you, oh, don't forget to chop them, okay, and some breads, the buns and there we go there we go okay one more star left okay so it's the same order perfect okay same order it's chopping up there we go oh no we lost the customer okay oh my gosh put it in there okay there we go um, okay, let's put this one in there, and, okay. There you go, one for you. Okay, so, 
Okay. Okay, one more customer. Okay. No, I don't want the letters. I want this. There we go. One for you. There we go. Five stars. Yay! We have got the feast egg. The chef egg. That just looks really cool, with the moustache and the eyebrows and that, and the hat. Okay, so since I've got all the eggs, I'm actually going to go to the under nest, where I need to go to that huge sort of like palace or castle, because it's kind of rare to get this sort of egg, and it requires you to ever to unlock this game. And once you complete the game, um, then you got yourself a prize. So yeah, that's how it works. But I'll show you when we get there, so I hopefully I'll know where it is. I think you just turn to this direction and it will lead you to the top bit where you've got more op optional paths of where to go. So, um, it's, it's quite high up there, but we can get there. You just have to be very steady. And this also requires of me using an umbrella because a few episodes ago of this I always kept falling down into the pit but the umbrella is literally so useful because if you just look it says it, it falls slower using the umbrella so it's not just for a rainy day but on here it's only for like for slow speeds if you have problems jumping onto another platform you can just use the umbrella so you can it, it'll be useful for like when you try and jump over it so Okay, let's do this. It's done it properly this time. Okay, so the skeleton bird is going to drop me down, and I have to. This requires a umbrella. So these barrows, I think they do something. Um, so there's like TNTs, dynamites, um, somewhere on the map. Um. Ah. Oh no. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ah, I'm kind of failing. How am I supposed to do this? Okay. Okay, here. No! Screw you. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, grab. Fall down. You pick me up and drop me down. Okay, put it here. Oh, I kind of failed that one.
Okay, press Q. Okay, just fall down. Picks me up. Okay, there we go. Okay, just fall down again. I don't know how to do the umbrella method, what people do. I just don't know really, so I'm just learning something here for myself. I've seen this is the last piece. Uh, Okay. Place dynamite. Oh. Yeah, place dynamite there. Okay, it's been activated. Ah! So you have to go in these barrels and they basically help you to avoid the bird. Ah! Okay, so there's dynamite. Okay, so you're meant to throw like dynamite up soon. Okay. Ah! Ah! I don't know how this works. Okay, what's the bookworm saying? He's saying nothing. What are you, what are you trying to say, bookworm? Okay. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. How is this even... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm missing some bits out here. Ah. Is there a way that I you can just hit the bird, not actually just like... Uh, how is this... Ah. So you meant to throw it at him. Oh my gosh, I'm losing health. Ah. Okay. Where can I pick up the dynamite? Ah. Ah, no. Oh my gosh. I think when he gets down, shoot the dynamite. Ah. So it's like when he gets down, throw a dynamite at him. No, don't get me near him. Drop some TNT so I can throw them at you. There you go. Oh no, he just popped my TNT. Damn it. Pick it up. Ah, oh, damn it. What am I supposed to do with this? How am I just am I just gonna drop it? Because I'm inflicting myself with my own damage. Oh, did I see something on his back? Is it telling me that I should just put something on his back then? Uh, 
Here you go. Ah, yes. Okay, it did do something. So you have to drop a dynamite at him. Like, put it in these, um, chest, uh, back area or something. When he flies down, that's where you do it. Ah, self damage. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh no, I think I should stop. When he flies down, I think that's the time where I should pick up the dynamite. Gosh, can you just come down so I can throw this at you? Uh. Oh, I think you meant to throw. I think that if you had a diamond in your hand, I think you can throw it at, at him. Instead of just waiting for it to come down, you can just pick it up a dynamite and then just um. Ah, not this time. Ah. Uh. Okay, this time. Ah. Ah. Okay. No. Ah, this is ridiculous. How is this even possible? Okay, get in there. Ah. Oh my gosh, you kidding me? That didn't even do anything. Are you are you are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Can I just throw it at you? Ugh. How can I even throw this? Oh my gosh, it's ridiculous. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's like the dynamites have got a time limit when they explode, and the problem is I'm inflicting self damage picking them up. This is taking for ages. Okay. There we go. Ah. Uh. 
He didn't even do anything. I think I, ah, I think I might know. I think I might know a trick. Hang on. Let's pick up this. Let me fall. Ah, oh, damn it! No. Okay, I'm I'm finished. <laughs>